nasty. Okay, it's like so cold that my camera won't stop fogging up. I feel like every vlog of mine is just me complaining. Just me complaining. Okay, manual focus. Welcome to the vlog. I'm meeting Tanisha today. It's been four months since I've met Tanisha. This is gonna be a very interesting vlog. I went to my sister's university. Also, it's snowing in Boston. It's gonna be a fun vlog. Please subscribe. I was basically on my way to meet Tanisha, but I forgot my SD card, so I came back. Yeah, it's been stressful. <laughs> but it snowed. I'm gonna show you like a little bit of snow that you can see. I'll show you guys more snow when I'm like in the snow. I don't know if you guys can see it, but like the ledges and shit have snow on them. Please ignore me if I'm awkward in the vlog. Hi, uh, I'm running very late. I need to take the train to go meet Denisha because Uber is really expensive. I've never like traveled alone in... Wait, I need to... Wait. It's like extremely cool. I'm gonna Google map my way into finding Boston University all by myself. Okay, we've made it. No suspicious looking people. Before this, when my sister and I traveled, that's probably the train. I'm missing it. That's probably, yes. I need to buy a ticket and shit. I think I've made it. I'm not sure though. I feel like I haven't made it though. Like Google Maps, I don't really trust you. I'm lost. Um, okay, I've made it to Boston University. I'm waiting for Tanisha to come down. I'm extremely, extremely excited. This is BU for the ones who haven't seen it. Um, yeah. Okay, I'm seeing people in shorts and I'm not trying to judge them because it's so so cool it's so cool Denisha is this Denisha my run is this my cousin am I meeting my cousin I feel like a two year old when you talk to me like that. <laughs> that's, that's way better than my need to buy it's been four months since we last met. Finish the sentence. This child over here came from Boston Common, and usually it takes about 10 15 minutes to reach from Boston Common to here. Guess how much time it's taken us? 40 minutes. <laughs> it's taken one hour. I missed you so much. Like, I genuinely missed you. Good. You should. Stop! Guys, I'm so jet lagged because I just saw that I'm really sleep only. Acha doesn't have my jet lag problems anymore so because he doesn't have to go back to India because he literally lives there. I have to go back and come Okay, but you know how much I'm... He doesn't understand how jet lagged I am and that I need to go and sleep before my classes. Okay, I'm on call with Valerie because I'm lost in Boston again. Like. Oh my gosh, he's so dumb. He literally got on the wrong fucking platform. I made it to Kenmore. I got lost like um, a couple times before those. I walked for 30 minutes. I made it home safely. Hi, I just want to pop in real quick and talk about something that's been bothering me. A lot of people have pointed out that I'm sounding different. I'm aware. It's my voice. I'm, I'm adapting and adjusting. I've moved to the US like permanently. I live in Fresno, California. But during my breaks and everything, I'm going to go back home in Fresno itself, like in California itself. But my friend groups have changed. My social situations have changed. I literally go to school here. Everything is just local. I feel like the last couple months of just like when I was like on a break, I've been more reflectful. I've chosen to like sound like my friends like my cousins my entire family lives in the u.s my cousins live in houston la i have a couple in berkeley i have a cousin in new york so i decided to like start sounding local i want to avoid like awkward social situations whenever i spoke like my first two months i spoke like the way i did before i had a little bit of an accent like my indian accent i used to like i wouldn't say get made fun of it was supposed to be harmless it really like bothered me even in class when i'm answering a question or 
if my teacher asks me something. I felt like a little shy, so I just decided to switch. Code switching is a very real thing. I'm adapting to my new life. In case you don't know, I used to live in LA before I moved to India in 2019. I moved back to the US like in like seven months ago. This is how my life is gonna be forever. I hope you respect my decision. Please don't send me hate for this. This is my life. This is my choice. I'm just here forever, so it just makes sense. If you don't agree with me, I really don't care. Your opinion does not matter to me because it's my life. Also, I personally feel like the way I talk should not be affecting anyone. I'm just trying to like adapt and adjust to like my new life. I knew before whenever I like moved back to the US for a couple months, I always knew like because of like certain situations I might have to go to India or live there for a couple months. Like I was back and forth like so many times in the last couple years respect my decision and if you disagree then don't watch me so we have come to boston commons in a raging blizzard you can see the snow like accumulating on my eyelashes and stuff this is so white i'm not even like let me show you it's been snowing there's a blizzard warning it's insane like the snow it's it's like so there's so much snow i just posted a video of me basically like vibing in the snow Please go watch it on Instagram, it's really cool. I would most definitely wanna like click pictures and just have fun in the snow, but it's so cold. And then I'm gonna head back in like a couple minutes. I feel like a kid in a candy store. I love it when it snows, I hate the cold. I'm just having fun. Okay, I'm like playing in the snow right now because it's so fun. Okay, little story time. I think Elsa from Frozen came and possessed me because I lost my phone. I was enjoying so much in the snow that I lost my phone. I started panicking. I came back to the apartment, I, you know, took my sister with me and we started searching in the snow. After like one whole hour, we finally found my phone. I actually don't even know where my phone is right now. Uh, yeah. <laughs>